now we are in Iceland. Iceland is about 103 square kilometers, so it's about the size of Kentucky. We're west of a town called Borganes in pretty much the middle of nowhere. This is our 15th trip, our first intergenerational. We have 12 kids from ages 9 to 12. They're old enough to remember it when they're grown and old enough to appreciate it, I think. Grandkids have someone to play with, the adults have someone to talk to, and we do a lot of things together. No one feels like they're all alone, and I think that's just a great thing that Rose Scholar does. Traveling with a grandchild provides an added experience that cannot be replaced with anything else. You get to show them the world. I think more importantly, you get to spend more time with them than you would otherwise. It's very special to have this time together get to know each other in different ways. What was the most fun thing about the whole trip? Being here with you guys. All of the Rhodes Scholar programs have an educational component. The role of Rhodes Scholar instructors give a dimension that we wouldn't have otherwise. They tell us history, they tell us why a certain site is significant. I know Iceland very well, and I hope I can convey that uh, information to both young and older people. I think I learned a lot of things that I wouldn't have learned. We are trying to do as much as we can, as long as we can. And Rhodes Scholar has been a perfect vehicle for us. We've had all kinds of activities. We've been in an ice cave up on a glacier. I'd uh, never been on a glacier before, and it was really very impressive. We went to museums. Very good and professional exhibitions, so people have gotten a good insight into the old time here in Iceland. Uh, we have been going to the swimming pools. We went horseback riding. Oh, that was awesome. It was a long ride, and we rode out and came back along the river. We learned all about sheep farming, and we learned about dairy farming, and saw some really interesting dairy equipment that automatically milked the cows. We went out on a working boat. Everybody got to taste uh, things from the sea, scallops, and sea urchins and mussels. I like the whole adventure of even though this is my uh, 12th time to Iceland, it doesn't matter, every day is really different. There is so much to learn about just being a human and uh, appreciate being alive. <laughs> I think everybody comes away with, gee, I can't wait to do this again with my next grandchild who's seven years old. It's such a nice trip. I want to thank her so much. Thank you for bringing me to Iceland. I love you. <laughs> I know you do. I love Iceland. <laughs>